I'm ready, Guru. I know, Milton, but. You ready to go for a ride? Good boy. Good boy, Tootie. Oh, he's my good boy. You see Maddie's relaxing in the back seat? Where's my Diddy Buds? <gasps> Mommy, come get her Diddy Buds. Good boy. Good boy, Diddy. Good boy. Good boy. Oh, my boy. My boy. Milton, you're breathing so hard. Okay, we just finished our walk. A good, what, 5.2 miles. Yep. I am at 11,000 steps. Whoa. So far, oh that is a great way to start the day. Are you out there doing your I mean, Are you challenge? exercising today? Like, what are you doing? Yes. Way to go, Mom. Ow! Did you enjoy your five mile walk today? Did I enjoy it? Mm -hmm. No. Am I glad that I did it? Yes. After three of them miles, I was like, well, this would be great if it was over. The three mile walk? Yes. I'm already at 11,223 steps today, what? so yeah, nailed that. That's kind that. of where I'm at. Is it? Uh, mine is 11,000. It's 223 <laughs> steps. Oh, JJ said, everybody ready for clean keto? I am. Are we? Or like, are we just doing it? You know, mm -hmm. I was going to have Zip Fizz this morning and I was like, skirt, not clean enough. So I did not have any Zip Fizz. I won't be having any this entire week. Oh, wow. I'm actually also skipping Bulletproof Coffee because I was trying to make it clean. Mm -hmm. But I realized like, if I can't have my collagen and if I can't have my sucralose, yes. I don't want it, you know? Okay guys, I am starting off the day with cello wisps. These are considered clean, okay? Because the only ingredient is cheese. Like, okay, so my rules for clean keto are if I eat anything in a package, it can only have three or fewer ingredients. And like, I have to know what all those ingredients are. Cello wisps, ingredients, cheddar cheese. That's it, okay? Cello wisps, ingredients, Parmesan cheese, okay? Like, even though it's technically processed, all they did was just dry this stuff out on a conveyor belt, okay? Something I could have easily done in my own oven, right? So I'm paying merely for the convenience, right? But these are still quality ingredients. So I'm gonna enjoy this and then I get like a bacon, egg, and cheese omelet today before taco tray, like, what? So I'm very excited, uh, but I'm going to have this. No coffee this week because I love my Bulletproof coffee with the mix-ins so much that like I didn't even want to figure out how to change it. I didn't want to say, well, I could substitute this and I could take this out and I could do that. Like I love it just the way it is so much that I'm like, if I can't have it like that, I don't want it at all. You know what I'm saying? So I'm going to enjoy this and I'll show you what I'm eating the rest of the day. Okay, everyone, now my husband is going to attempt the impossible. Oh my He's going to flip my omelet. Oh my goodness, are you ready? I, are you ready? Oh, but look how he just jiggles it around in the pan like that. What's how you tell? So much skill. Ugh. You see how the bubbles go around the edges? That's how you know it's kind of ready, but it's still like a little loose in the middle. Oh, it's loose? it is loosey goosey. Right. So it's still far from finished. Okay. So what I'm gonna do is flip it once just to kiss the underside and flip it again. And then kiss the underside? Who talks like that? No. <laughs> All right. Okay. Oh. Wow, that was still pretty great though. Mm -hmm. Look at that! Sit for half of a second. Oh, oh my god, now the butter. You can smell the butter from the underside that was kissed. Exactly. Oh my goodness. And this is just to warm up the bottom. Oh, and he flipped it back. Oh my word. Here's my husband taking pictures for Instagram. Not letting me eat the food he just <laughs> made for me. All I want to do is eat the food, Richard. Yeah, not so but here you are just getting however many snaps of an omelet. Oh my gosh. I love you so much. I love you so much. Oh my god, I love this so much. Oh, it looks so good. Okay guys, so my omelet is finally 
totally off the stove. I'm so excited. This is just two eggs and a tablespoon of butter with a slice of cheese and two pieces of bacon are in the omelet and then two pieces are on the side. Honestly, I was just thinking the bacon is probably the quote unquote dirtiest ingredient I'm going to have this week. But if, you know, bacon being dirty is wrong, I don't want to be right. You know, that's what I'm saying. Like, I'm going to enjoy all of this bacon every day this week and you ain't gonna tell me nothing all right but i am going to just ah oh, dig into this omelet that my husband flipped a million times for me mm, it looks so good so steamy can you see the steam oh mm. Mm. oh it is buttery it is salty the cheese is smokehouse cheddar-y. It's bacony. Oh, this is so great. If you can't have your sweet chocolate bulletproof coffee, this is legit the next best thing. I mean, this is delicious. Well, I'm just gonna savor every bit of this uh, and then it'll be lunchtime and then it'll be football and the world is right. Okay guys, I have been in the kitchen for what feels like forever. I had chopped cilantro, I had to chop jalapenos, I had to make that homemade aioli. There was no chipotles, but I put in a lot of good stuff. I put in some diced tomatoes, I put in some chili powder and paprika. And then after that, like the flavor was really good, but I just needed more heat. So I straight up added hot sauce like to the mix and the chipotle aioli is delicious. Uh, you can see my taco tray looks a little different, but it's in here okay we don't have any guacamole we don't have any quest chips we don't have any of that taco bell fire sauce that i love so much but that's okay we got some plain pork rinds normally i dip my pork rinds in the guacamole but this week i just put some of that chipotle mayo on top of those and i'm gonna you know kind of mix it in as nachos but everything else is still the same i got my cheese i got my sour cream i got my ground beef like oh i am so excited you also see I got that egg loaf going there. I used the Lakanto liquid monk fruit that is cleaner than the sucralose that I normally put into my egg loaf. The ingredients, water, monk fruit extract, natural citrus flavors. Like, sounds good to me, so I'm excited about that. I put some cinnamon, some maple extract. That's gonna be serving as my dessert because I really don't have anything with other sweeteners in it. So I'm gonna have my taco tray 
I'm gonna have my egg loaf and cheese and then some Zevia if I want it. Like that's my only option. Zevia and water this week. So like, yay. Okay guys, right now I have the most distracted camera person on earth because my husband cannot keep his eyes Excuse off me. of the Eagle Steelers game. So I'm not gonna take up, <laughs> I'm not gonna take up too much of his time. I got uh, cheese here and I have this delicious, amazing egg loaf that I'm just, Mm, so excited about so I'm gonna eat the cheese first and finish off the day with the sweets and then uh, Really just have water. I mean, that's about it So I'll let you know if I have a ZV or anything like that But like right now we are getting our entire lives with egg loaf and NFL So have a good day and I'll let you know if I eat anything else ah, What are you doing? I'm following, yeah, that's my what baby. following me. Oh my god I got some McGrill Oh my god, it feels great out here I know, right? And like the sun and everything Wow so okay, babe, tell us what you're doing here. You got these three massive steaks. I know. Well, Mama Chris uh -huh. uh, decided that she wanted me to try out some steaks on the new grill. Okay. And she donated one to me. Yes. Where is your donated steak, sweetheart? You gonna save it? Okay. You're gonna. Of course, you're gonna save it. Yeah. Uh, wow. Yes, you done put some spices oil, on the New York strips. A olive oil and uh, some Montreal seasoning. Oh. It's about to smell awesome out here. Mm -hmm. Oh, jeez. Wow. Looking good, babe. Just like my husband. I decided I did want some Zevia after all. This is ginger ale, but you notice it's clear. So with Zevia, there are no colors or anything. So even their regular cola flavors are clear. It really throws you off, but okay, this is the ginger ale. Canada dry, it is not, but that'll do good. I mean, that'll do for a soda for clean keto week, so not too bad. Okay guys, I am calling it a day. Overall, clean keto, it's gonna be a breeze. I mean, it's really good to do these exercises sometimes because, you know, you get so settled in your routine. You get so dependent upon your sweeteners and your snacks and your processed packaged food products. And you start to think that, you know, you can't go without them. And that's just simply untrue, okay? Like, I ate completely clean keto whole foods today for the most part. And guess what? I didn't die. And I also feel kind of great too, you know? So I am excited to go the rest of the week eating like this. But overall, today was a good day. The Seahawks are losing, so I don't know what's gonna happen there, but like, I'm going to sleep. Are you participating in the Clean Keto Challenge? Comment down below. If you're not, just think about it. Comment down below, what do you consider clean keto or what are some rules that you think constitute clean keto? I would love to hear your definition because we've been going back and forth about this in my Facebook group and on my YouTube lives, but I wanna hear what you have to say. Comment down below. What is clean keto to you? Thank you so much for watching this video. If you like it, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel, Watch Autumn Keto. I make weekly meal preps, weekly full days of eating, monthly weigh-ins, monthly keto crate and box unboxings, the occasional product review and recipe. You can also follow me on Instagram, Facebook, and Patreon at Watch Autumn Keto. Thanks and I'll see you next week. Bye. Stop everybody was like, your hair is beautiful. Uh, yes. Is that what she, she did? She was at a stoplight. See, just the cars are so loud. It's okay. Shh. Exactly, we're freaking filming. Mommy. You salt and pepper it, right? Yes, I did. Okay. It does look good. It does look good. Thank you. I want to eat it. So what I'm having in this place is two scrambled eggs and butter and four slices of bacon. Today? Yeah. This whole week. Hello, car. Did you just No say? respect. I mean. Wow. Okay. The right. nerve. Um, I was like, so here's your so hair crazy. is great. No, your hair. She didn't say anything about my person. But she said your hair is so hair. pretty. Yes. The rest of the face complimented the hair.